Mercy Children's Hospital says two children might have a mysterious illness tied to COVID-19. It's called Pediatric Multisystem Inflammatory Syndrome, or also PIMS. The Tennessee Department of Health says there are currently no confirmed cases in the state. Tennis reporter Grace King spoke with Children's Hospital about the potential cases and what we know about this illness. This illness is making some children very sick. The doctors say it's rare and treatable, meaning not a reason to panic. It's a very small number of children. Across the nation, a mysterious illness is popping up in children. We think that the symptoms are from these antibodies that develop uh, after you have the infection. Doctors are calling it pediatric multisystem inflammatory syndrome or PIMS. Sometimes the antibodies recognize your own organs and tissues as something they should also attack and they cause inflammation and problems there that need to be treated. Dr. Joe Childs of East Tennessee Children's Hospital says the most common symptoms are high fever, rash and stomach pain, as well as vomiting or diarrhea. These kids tend to look sick. He says if these symptoms are noticeable, your child should be evaluated. I think there's a little bit of fear about coming to the emergency room or coming to the hospital. It's important to know uh, we've never been safer. Plus, Dr. Child says there is a way to treat these cases. The treatment that we've always had for Kawasaki syndrome seems to reverse the symptoms of this, uh, this quite well. Children says they're still waiting on antibody test results to determine whether those two patients have this COVID-19 related illness. Even if they do, Dr. Child said it's important to remember it's rare and treatable. Back to you.